Hello and welcome back. So this episode might be a little bit longer than normals. Also, also I'm here with Luis, as always. Um, I'm here. Oh, uh... As you can see, I got the... I got the teleport cancel down. She has this space drum. So yeah, I've been practicing a bit. So um, basically, I already told Luis about this, but um, when we were uh, when I was editing uh, when I was editing part twelve, I think it was. No, it wasn't part twelve. It was way later. I think it was part seventeen or something. Uh, we were going through this pathway over here when. Um, when uh, when like when I was looking at the editing, I realized that we passed an artifact area, which don't ask me my attention to detail on that because even I still don't know how. I was just like, oh, how did I see that or whatever. So I'm about to show you guys. Um, I mean, I, I I'll go ahead and play back the footage just so you guys can see like where I saw it. Yeah, th throw in the Crunchyroll ad. That's not sponsored. I doubt. I bet they have some. Some, uh... Well, yeah, they have some. Okay, then if you guys didn't see it there, then you're about to now. Well, first let me kill this guy. Uh, okay. So, now, Luis, I want you to pay attention. Like, see these, see those red blocks right there? You see how, like, a solid red? Watch what happens to them when I go to the left. Wait. Do you see that? I don't see them. No, but... Did you see the static, though? Okay, I kind of see it. Dang it. Yeah, it's really hard to get this one. Dang it. Because I have to, like, double tap while I'm... Okay, let's see. Dang it. It's really hard to do, but I've gotten in here before. Dang it. Yeah, this is, this is probably going to take a while. Okay. Dang it. Wait, can I just do diagonal? Ah, there we go. Hmm. Yeah. So welcome to an artifact area, everyone. I found this out during... I found I found this during my recording. If you can believe it. Now, th I'm, I'm not... The reason why Luis is not on the controller for this part of the episode is because, well, you can see his favorite things are right here. As you can see. Actually, you know what would make this easier? If I just if I just uh, did that. That way they bug and they like can't even move, hardly. They do quite a bit of damage though. Oh crap, those ones are those ones didn't get bugged. But yeah, this place is like extremely difficult. Like the artifact areas are meant to as like a little hidden challenge of the sort. Okay. I did that all for the sake of staying freaking mentally sane from these freaking guys. So I'm curious as to what we're probably finding here. No clue. Yeah, okay, so this is as far this is pretty much as far as I got because these guys are dicks. So I figured out like what happens when you bug these guys is that um Okay, I'm trying to like trying to like teleport jump, okay. As you can see on the map now, I have not made it this far. Oh fuck. Okay, when they get on me, I've got to remember to dash. Yeah, that's right. That hurts them. Yeah, which is nice. Do you think the letters from those guys have any significance? The letters? Yeah, like whenever I bug them, like letters just appear on them. Well, like, and the letters could be like either white or yellow or something. God damn, how high is this? I like how because the static fraps is like recording is at like not the full 60 FPS or something. Oh fuck. Nope. Okay.
Yeah, I, I mean, I have no idea what we're gonna find in here. Well, we're making progress at least. Damn it. It's really hard to not fall. Okay. Bam. Oh, okay, okay. I see where I need to go. I need to go to this side, actually. Okay. Oh, there's just a hole in the floor right there. Why did that guy just get stuck right there? I can't... Oh. Dude, that's weird. I was able to go through it, but that time I couldn't. Um, I'm gonna throw an address bomb for safety. Okay. Oh. Oh, sweet. Health? Damage? No, that's health. It's a health node. Oh, we only need one more. Well, that was a handy. Yeah, you can see that I've gotten that down. It's really helpful once you learn how to do it. Okay, that was kind of pointless, but... You know, touching those guys don't do that much damage, but if you, like, freaking touch... If their beams hit you, you just take so much damage, it's like, now you're right. Okay. Come on, come on. Oh, crap. Yeah, there's like branching pathways in these artifact areas. Like, like apparently, like the artifact areas are in different places, and the maps different. Like through each playthrough, even depending on what like save slot you're at, what save slot you're using, which is kind of interesting. But in speedrun mode, these these artifact areas are like completely are completely removed. Because like whenever you look at speedrun mode, it says removes all random elements from the game. Like, these are the random elements that it was talking about. Uh, boom. Not much talking about going on here. Um, so yeah, um, one thing I do want to apologize for is my lack of uploads. Even though like I already had part, um, I already had part 17 ready to go. I already had part 18 ready to go before uh, before I uh, recorded this. But um, the, uh, sorry for the long delay, by the way. But it's just that like a bunch of stuff has been going on. So damn it, I can get up there. Uh, I, I, I got the new Digimon game, Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. It's actually a, a legitimately really good Digimon game. It's like the kind of Digimon game I've been waiting for for like years. God damn. Gotta just do that. Ooh. Heat Seeker. Projectiles attract towards enemies. What does that mean? There's so many... So many weapons. It makes you wonder... Like... Do you really need them all? Well, I mean, if you want to go for 100%, probably. Is it's, that it? It's ridiculous. Do you think that's really it? The Heat Seeker and a Life Up? Yeah. Because <laughs> I know the Heat Seeker is not in a... Oh wow, that's cool. Like you see how it just like automatically turned towards them? Yeah. Well it's a seeker. This is probably like I don't know. You see like it's even trying to like it's even trying to like go towards that guy. It was it looked like it was pretty strong too. It took that guy down pretty quick. Can I not go up here? No I can't.
Okay. Sadly, um, yeah, that's probably like the only, the fastest way to get out of the artifact area. So yeah. So we got a new weapon and a health node fragment. Wow. Which, believe it or not, um, yeah, it's so like I said, speedrun mode does not have the heat seeker, as far as I'm aware. Because artifact area items do not count towards 100%. At least, I don't think so. Hmm. But this weapon's cool, though. It fires really fast. It could become really strong. Like, look at this. You don't even have to aim anymore. Yeah, you don't. They like kill him in like three shots. That's cool. Oh yeah, I need to look at my map. Okay, now where we're actually supposed to go. I know where we're actually supposed to go. So, I'm gonna go ahead and cut to there. But first, I kind of found this. I kind of found this item like by mistake, actually. Then again, in my hard mode playthrough, so I don't know what to say about it. But right here. Wow. Yep. Ion beam. Fire beam. That was a weapon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a beam. And you could just miss that. Yeah. So yeah, while I was playing single player on my hard mode, I mean, I found more items in my hard mode than I have on here, but I didn't take my hard mode uh, any further than to where we got on the playthrough. So, okay. Okay, now enough of that. Speed it up. All right, and we're back. So yeah. Also, yeah. If you like, see that bottom, that pit down there. If you did, yeah. There you go. Wow. Yep. Is that a health fragment? Do we have health? No, that's a power wow. node fragment. We only need two more of those though, but I don't know if we're gonna find any. But um. Yeah, just keep going up. Well, look at your map real quick. And you press the uh, back. Or, yeah, that works too. Um, you need to see that see that path that uh, that cut off pathway up there at the top that goes up. Yeah. That's where we need to go. So just uh, yeah. So this head straight up. Yeah, you might want to bug them first, or something. Oh, okay. <laughs> I even like how you kind of ninja the, uh... You can even kind of like, n somehow ninja those, uh, health pickups. Oh, that's an enemy. Yeah. No, oh, okay. You just see the power behind that thing. Yeah, it's pretty strong. Oh yeah, here's another item I found. Luis, go ahead and bug that thing. Alright, now make it jump. Yeah, and then shoot your drone in there. Yeah, go left. And you see how there's like a little crevice hole right there? There you go. Wow. Yep. Another power node fragment. Ah, uh, we only need one more power node fragment and one more health node fragment. Yeah, just go ahead and press B. Or, I knew you were going to do that, regardless. <laughs> yeah, and then you just kind of jump out of there. You're going to have to, like, kind of take the hit, though. Like, or no, I guess you can kill it. 
Then press Y. There you go. That thing's just like really strong. Those guys don't want none. <laughs> I like how you, after you, when you try dashing upwards, you just like stay perfectly still. Alright. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and save. This, that looks like a boss. Though. No, that's where we fought that hallucination. Oh. So, yeah. But we do have to go in there, though. Trace. Mm. Wow, El Snova? Yes, drones repaired my body before other Rusalki. Trace, I am sorry for my reaction earlier. You should not carry the carry blame for Athetos's crimes. Okay. Ahead is elevator to breach. Ath Athetos is inside. I do not ask you to kill him. Just shut down breach attractor. But he will try to stop you. As always, there is a weak point. Find and destroy it. Once Breach recedes, I can help, but I cannot survive in Breach, so be careful. <clears throat> Athetos lives, okay? We lock him up or something, but no killing. No killing. Thank you. So, this is you? I was originally soldier. Does it frighten you? I think I was already at some point beyond fear. Ah oh, crap, I forgot what I was going to say. Thanks for apologizing. Please don't kill me again. I won't. Be careful, Athetos is devious. You cannot trust him. I'll keep that in mind. Also by the way, Luis, um, yeah, why don't you shoot your drone up? Like dash up and then shoot your drone up. You see that right up there? There's like a little alcove up there. Hmm. Nah. I'm wondering, do you actually have to try and drone teleport cancel in order to get up there? No, it's basically, here's how you do it. Well, I got this. You, <laughs> you're doing it way too fast. <laughs> oh. Okay. There you go. Yeah. Um. Oh, those things hurt you. What hurts me? The grass. Yeah. You're shooting up. Does that mean you go up? Oh god, it's more of those exploding things with bugs. Go ahead and like fire an address bomb up there first. Alright, alright, alright. In order to do that. You, you press. Okay, you press L2. There you go, you should have gotten them with that. Yeah, you did. Okay, you should be alright now. Now just try to get your way up there. Um. Um. um Why? Okay. So just go a bit more to the right. No big, like right no there. Big. Okay, that was like way no too big. early. <laughs> uh, it's fun watching you try. Okay. Ah. Okay, so if you just dash up and shoot straight up and just go go like to the left. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Don't press me. There you go. That's why. Look at that health. But go ahead and get that weapon first. Gosh. Do you can break those? It's turbine pulse. The way this weapon works is that you hold it and it has like a, sh a damaging shield in front of you. Like if you try firing it. It does that, but if you like... But if you keep firing after it's fully charged like that... It's weird to understand. 
You kind of have to hold like each time you press, if that makes sense. A little bit faster. Yeah. And now, like basically, when it's fully charged, when it's fully like loaded up like that, you pretty much just like keep, like keep pressing it, because that way it'll stay uh, open like that. But I'd probably stick with the heat seeker though. The heat seeker is just like genuine, genuinely better. It's right there. Okay. All right then. So I think that's pretty much it. That's it here. Yeah. Oh, you could have just gone there through that. That's a thing. Okay then. <laughs> I even like how you press B still. All right. So, to the breach elevator. Nice one. Or wait, what about that? Right there to the left. That looks like something you can dash down, doesn't it? That's why. <laughs> you know, <laughs> sometimes I wonder. Yeah, I knew it. Do not press one. Okay, I don't. Uh, you know what? Whatever. You press whatever button you feel like pressing. Oh, look at that! I don't know what it is. Is it a health node? Yep. Health node. We got health. Moved up a tiny bit. Look how long our health bar is now. It's like a worm. I thought she was like a giant humanoid thing. Yeah. Yeah, me too. So yeah, up we go. To breach. No, right there. Oh. This looks kind of familiar, doesn't it? You say that. <laughs> Let's see. It's just a block. Try bugging it. I guess it's only when it's open you can hurt it. Be careful, look dude, it almost killed you. Alright. Oh, Try bugging it, see what happens. Oh, that's oh, that's oh, that's okay, there you go. Dude, <laughs> dude. Alright then, that works. I get the feeling there's a safe station right there. I'm just the hunch. No, I guess not. I called it wrong. Wait, go be go behind the wall, see if you can come down. Or no, wait, you're bugging him. Oh god, okay. That wasn't that far back. <laughs> you know what? Um, no, wait, no. It was like 14 minutes with that artifact area, so you're still good. Let's keep you going for about like four more minutes, and then we'll end the episode. Alright, we'll spend it all in here. Wh um, <laughs> up here, right? No! <laughs> There's nothing... Okay, yeah. I think in Metroid Fusion there was one point where there was a power up in a save room. Or more or less like right right behind it or something. No. <laughs> Nothing up here, right? No, that's where we're supposed to go. <laughs> you need to get like some control. <laughs> Because you're just like, like, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> yeah. 
It's just that kind of reminds me of Tori, and that's all. This place, because it's white and everything. Yeah, you gotta bug it, remember? Or, that works. If you're fast enough. Damn, look how much damage he did to you with that laser. Alright, try going up instead. Dude, I just I just don't think you can hurt him, hurt them with like normal weapons. Why is he moving so fixated? Oh, there's a safe station. <laughs> they went the wrong way. Wow. Where I thought there was a. What are you doing? Oh. Okay then. Chair noises. Chair noises. Lots of chair noises. We need to get better chair noises. Yeah, we need to get better chair noises. All right. That's cool. It's a big health bar. Yeah. <clears throat> He's, he's really fixated for some reason. I think he, it's because he's like turning back. No, it's weird. He's fighting the virus. Oh my gosh. This ain't directly up there. That's what I was doing. No, you weren't. You were oh shooting diagonally. Gosh. See, he's back. No, that's a different one. No, it's the same one. No, it's not. There's two in this room. This is where Luis died. Nothing? Oh, there we go. Did it hit the center? Wait a minute. Did it hit the center? Wait, wait, wait a second. Stop shooting. Hold up. Now, now hold down. Now hold left. <laughs> oh. You're controlling it. And you touched it. <laughs> nice. Go all the way down. He's not shooting. Fuck you. Pretty sure that's nothing. <laughs> what the heck? You, you shot. It was nothing. Oh no! You have to shoot it with the laser. Is it hurting me? No. Wait, wait. Bring the laser down. Yeah, bring, bring the laser bring down. Bring like hold down. Oh, get over here. I can shoot with it. Exactly. It's your pet, but you can hurt yourself. Yeah. It's nothing. Yeah, just try going up then. <clears throat> oh, there's another one. There's, there's the other one. Yeah, there's the other one. You killed it! <laughs> Done. That's a red door, by the way, Louise. But it's just a giant one of those things. Shoot at it. It shoots cool. He has the same weapon I do. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You can just hold the button. You can just hold the button. You just hold it, really? Yeah. That's crazy. There's, no, there's nowhere to go. No! Hooray! You did it. You went somewhere. Oh, his health is still the same, though. It's because he unlocked the door. You can lock the door in boss rooms, please. Oh, you got him. Watch out. Watch out for bullets. Sentinel. There's a, Look, there's a path up there. I think without this fucking it would have been much harder. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure the plasma beam, I don't know, could deal that good against that guy. Yeah, those are the purple ones that we saw like in the hidden place at the very beginning. That have like a lot of health. 
Oh, look, there's a full health node right there. Mm. Ooh, hurt me all you want, fool. Hurt me all you want. Dang it. Well, hurt me all you want, fool. Okay, he's coming back down. Okay, that's good. That's good. <clears throat> what does that mean? That's a full health node. So, it... they didn't do as much as the other one. That's because, no, it's because that, that's one segment. Yeah, just like, yeah. Like, this is like the weapon for you. Don't worry about it. You kill me Hold, Hold on, is there something here we should know about? Oh, should I have a look? Yeah. <laughs> Do your downwards or the Bomba. The Zar Bomba. Oh wait, don't we need just one more health node fragment? Yeah, we just need one more power node fragment, don't we? I think so. How do we get that? Maybe to the right, or up. We become invisible. We become 3D and go beside the lizards. <laughs> go beside. Who is this, Paper Mario? Super Paper Mario? Mega Super Ultra? Is there like another path or something we're supposed to take that takes us in there? Yeah. Raise your voices, question mark. <laughs> Raise your voices, question mark. <laughs> I also have a question. No <laughs> way, let me not answer it. <laughs> Um, what are you doing? I'm looking at stuff. Oh, cool, me too. So we probably don't have anything in our arsenal to get that door open? <laughs> oh god. Mm. Mm. Well, he just kind of cooperated, didn't he? Please. Yeah, that's two blocks high. You can just dash up through that. Or... Oh my god! He's a good- Oh my god, you have so oh much health. God. Oh my god! There we go. I've got, Maybe yeah. you can shoot some. Oh, look, there's a save point. So, next time... I beat the next boss. Where are you going with that? I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm the one next on the controller. What are you talking about? Oh. He yeah. did say Wii. 